the 2014 F-150 6.2 liter V8. We're going to be doing a before and after comparison in four different stages. First, stock versus an MPT 93 Performance Custom Tune. Then we're going to install an AFE cold air intake and do another run stock and then throw on the MPT tune and see if we can increase it even more. Part of our calibration process is to connect our aftermarket knock sensor to the engine. These trucks come with a very reliable knock sensor, but there truly is no comparison to strapping on some headphones and listening to the engine run while we perform these dyno tests. Another thing we do is connect our aftermarket wideband sensor to check the air fuel, make sure everything is good to go. And then lastly, we strap it down to our Dynacom 15000 load bearing control dyno. First pull, not bad at all, 360 horsepower and 401 foot-pounds of torque. Looking pretty good already. Let's see if we can get some more power out of it though. Knock ears really are amazing. You gotta hear what this sounds like. We have them connected to the engine. We can listen to the engine running and double check the factory knock sensors to see if there's really any knock. Check this out. There's a lot of noise in there because you can hear every little tidbit of the engine. But after training your ear, you can actually distinguish what's true knock and what's just regular engine noise. Just completed four stages of testing and I must say the results are pretty good. Looking at this graph here, we have stock versus our 93 performance tune. Stock we put down 325 horsepower and 372 foot-pounds of torque. After installing our MPT tune, we were able to increase the power to 379 horsepower and 419 foot-pounds of torque. That is an increase of 47 foot-pounds at peak torque and an extra 53 horsepower. The next comparison we have is the AFE intake on a stock tune versus the AFE intake on an MPT performance tune. On that one, stock put down a little more, 319 horsepower and 373 foot-pounds of torque. And with the tune, we made an increase of up to 388 horsepower and 415 foot-pounds of torque. So an extra 69 horsepower over stock. This next graph is an overlay of all four stages on one. Here you can see the light gray is the stock tune with the stock intake. A little bit darker gray is the AFE intake on a stock tune. And then we have the orange, which is the MPT tune with the stock intake. And blue is the MPT tune with the AFE intake. You can see on the stock tune with the AFE intake, it actually does lean out the mixture slightly, but we're not seeing a huge increase in power. Got a little bit of gains in here, but not as much as you would hope from an intake by itself. Uh, it does increase the horsepower with the tune by an extra 10 or so, so it's doing its job. 
Peak horsepower is 388 versus 378 on the tune with the stock intake. types of results on your 6.2 liter, head over to our website at morepowertuning.com.